Hi guys, it's me again and welcome to my channel. Today for my very, very first uh, YouTube video, I have something very special for you because I got this magic chest in the mail. Uh, so if you're curious about what's in this box, please keep watching. So uh, first some information about this gorgeous box. Um, Magic Chest is a book box, a monthly book box from Germany. So uh, every month you can buy uh, a box which contains a book with goodies. Um, unfortunately, I was a tiny bit too late to get uh, their latest box because it was sold out. Um, but then I went to uh, Snoop in their store and there I saw they were still um, selling items from their previous boxes. Um, eventually I ordered four of them that I really wanted, uh, which are also in this box. Um, but then I also saw they were having a mystery bag sale and you could uh, buy a small bag or a big bag. Um, and each of those would contain um, items from their previous boxes that I still had in stock. Uh, now the fun part about it was that when you ordered, you could... Um, leave a comment uh, behind from um, the things you like and things you didn't like. So they could, you know, give it a personalized um, search. So um, in my case, um, I put in that I don't like to drink tea. So uh, they didn't include any tea normally in my box. Um, and that I love anything fantasy like Harry Potter and Narnia and stuff like that. So I'm very curious about what they put in this. Um, aside from my four ordered items, of course. So let's dive in. First thing I see is this beautiful card, which has a personalized message from uh, the owner of Magic Chest, Clara. Um, she thanks me for ordering um, a box and the goodies um, and hopes I st and hope I stay safe in this um, difficult time. So yeah, very fun to start with. Then there is something paperish. I think it's a poster because it's like glossy paper. Yes, it's a poster. With to make a true choice, one must have true knowledge. I think it is. Yeah, knowledge. And from the, I don't know if you guys see it well, but from the runes, we can assume it's a Shadow Hunter poster from uh, the Mortal Instruments from Cassandra Clare. I like the designs, really pretty. Yeah, I think I'm gonna hang it on my door later. Great start. Ooh, then I see something. Next item is something textile <laughs> so as I said I had um, put in the comment box that I uh, love Harry Potter and this is like a gym bag with um, the glasses and lightning bolt scarf from Harry Potter so yeah really cute don't know what I'm gonna use it for yet but I'll find something <laughs> and otherwise I just hang it on my wall because it's pretty. Um, next, this is, I think, one of the items I ordered. Yes. So this is um, a pillowcase, not a really big one. It's more for like a throw pillow or something. Um, it's also Harry Potter themed, of course. Um, it has a beautiful art. I hope you guys can see that. Um, and it has uh, the quote of Snape on it, after all this time, always. So yeah, when I saw they had this in their store, I basically immediately put it in my, uh, in my chart to uh, buy it. So this will be a lovely, lovely pillow for uh, in my office. Which one next? Which one next? I think this one is pretty. 
Um, it's a candle, uh, which with remedies, uh, color star, cinnamon, and uh, orange. And I'm gonna open it. it. Smells amazing, and it looks pretty too. I'm not gonna completely tilt it because then everything will fall out but it has <laughs> like dried flowers and stuff in it it smells really nice and the fact that it's called um witchwood remedy is uh fun too because i'm into wicca and stuff like that so yeah this one will get a nice place in my bookshelves um then we'll go for this one. Uh, this one I'm gonna open it because I think the plastic will reflect too much of the light. It's one of those um, simple wishing uh, necklaces. I have one of them. Uh, I've had one of them before. This one has a crown. Um, basically, it's like a very simple design of a necklace with. In this case a crown as a pendant but you also have like a cross or uh, some nothing work celtic nothing work or, or, or a heart or something like that and um the purpose of these necklaces is basically that you hold the pendant before you um, put it on and make a wish and then um put your necklace on and later on uh, your wish will come true it's really cute well <laughs> again really cute Yeah, I like it, even though it's cold because I'm I'm more of a silver kind of girl, but I like it. Yeah. Um we also have a sticker with criminal mastermind on the side. Don't know from which fandom this is, but I like the design, so I think I'm gonna stick it on my book trolley. It reminds me of the yellow submarine, the song from the Beatles, so yeah. <laughs> um, next we have some cards, but it's, it are two of the same like business cards from uh, her magical tea company with in the front Beauty and the Beast rose which is my favorite fairy tale so no complaints there um next item is this cute burlap bag with again gonna get the threads away the uh, logo of magic chest and from the rattling i think these are going to be pins and buttons let's see Oh yes. First thing is this button, which has a bit of Lord of the Ring vibes, especially with the text Lost Traveler, which is true because when you read a book you get lost between the pages, so yeah. <laughs> Cute. And then there is uh, this pin, and from the look of it I think I think it has something to do with Sailor Moon. Don't know if you guys see it well enough. But I, I never been into the Sailor Moon saga, but I've seen a few clips and this reminds me of it. So I think it's Sailor Moon, but I'm not sure. But still, it's pink, it has a pentagram and moons. I love it. <laughs> then we have a cute notepad with clouds and stars. Now I'm um, an avid writer, so you can never have too many notepads. And I'm gonna zoom in a bit. I don't know if you guys can see the stars and the little magic chest logo again. So yeah, I'm gonna use it to do a, to make a lot of to-do lists, I think because it's quite a thick uh, notepad, so yeah, this one is, comes very handy. 
Um, then we have a tote bag and I think, yeah, this is also one of the items I uh, ordered. This is their, um, I think it was called dark, dark side um, tote bag. Um, it's a rather small one, but cute. Um, it has the quote, come to the dark side. And then you have a lot, but a lot of art that I just love, like the, the kitten on the moon. And then you have uh, the castle and the wolf and the bat and the stars. Um, yeah, it's, it's really me. So <laughs> when I saw it, even though I have a lot of tote bags and my mom thinks I'm going crazy buying tote bags, um, I just had to have this one when I saw it. So, so shh, don't tell my mom that I bought another one. Um, and then we seem to have some art prints. Uh, first of all, we have a set of three gorgeous illustrated bookmarks. The first one uh, is from, I think it's from Curval, because it has like circus tents and dice and stuff on it. And on the other end is the quote, remember it's only a game, and then Stephanie Garber, which is the author of it. Then, again, because uh, as I said, I had the um, Lord of the Rings vibes with the button. This is a Lord of the Rings bookmark with um, the forest and the mountains. And here you have like a tiny um, wooden sign that points away. And on the other side is the most famous quote from uh, Tolkien, not all who wander are lost. And then the last bookmark is one of um, Rissa Meyer from the Cinder, uh, the Lunar Chronicles, like Cinder and Scarlet um, class. I have them all in my bookshelf somewhere. Um, and on the other side is maybe there isn't such a thing as faith. And again, the name Rissa Meyer on the other side. Oh, this is a postcard, but I, I love the design of it. It's like some, some whimsical field where you can find fairies or something. So yeah, it's cute. And now we get to the bottom of the box, which are a few art prints. Oh, I love this one. This one is very pretty. I'm a sucker for um, road signs. And in this one you have like... Hogwarts and the Secret Garden and the Shire and Neverland and Wonderland and Narnia and it's really gorgeously uh, illustrated here you even have Oz with the red slippers so yeah it's it's really gorgeous the other art print is uh, a darker one with a quote and I think it's from the Grisha universe Greed bows down to me. It is my uh, servant and my le uh, lover from Cass Brecker. Oh, it's double sided, so <laughs> as you guys can see. I think I'm gonna put this one in my book with efforts. <laughs> uh, really like this one. And then the last two ones are um, art prints that I bought. Um, first of all, again, we have the Harry Potter one um, with the tale of the three brothers. Um, and it's like the design is exactly like in the movies. So when, yeah, I'm a huge HP freak, so I had to have this one. And as I said earlier, um, my favorite fairy tale is Beauty and the Beast. And of course, they also had an art print of the rose. And roses are my favorite flowers. Um, and the fact that it's like the um, gloss around it, it's, it's just so gorgeous. <laughs> and yeah, I, I adore it. 
This was actually, I think, the first one that I put in my basket before even the pillowcase. So yeah, this one also is going to get a beautiful place in my bookshelf, in my bookcases, because I think I still have some place left somewhere. I'll find a place. Um, so that was the bottom of the box. You can see it's empty already. Um, I, even though this wasn't their regular book box, I really loved this one um, because of yeah all of the goodies. I mean, how can you not be happy? Um, the things I loved were basically everything. Um, of course, yeah, the pillowcase and the art prints and the tote bag and yeah, no, basically everything. I, I loved everything. So there's not an item that I liked less. Um, yeah, I, I adored it. So I'm definitely going to keep following uh, Magic Chest uh, in the hope I can get their book box as well. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you uh, would like to subscribe to my channel, please do. And if you want to get a notification whenever I post a new video, don't forget to click on that bell uh, button. Um, Normally there will also be an unboxing, but then with pictures on my uh, blog, from which you'll find the link later. Um, and yeah, I think that's, that's, that's about it. So thank you guys for watching and hopefully I see you guys soon.